Hey guys, Andrews RC here, and today I'm going to be doing something um, a little different. And as you can see, this is not an RC. This is a vintage garden tractor that goes with my many others that are in there. Um, and yeah, what this is is a 1966 Wheel Horse 1056. I got this from my uncle for free, and uh, yeah, so just do a little walk around here. And as you can see, I have this dump cart attached because I was just moving dirt for um, some of the holes we had to fill. And this is a simplicity dump cart, which goes to another cut tractors we have, me and my dad. Um, but yeah, I got that dump cart for 75 bucks. And yeah. Now, this thing may look like a um, piece of junk and should go to the scrapyard, but it does not need to. This is its patina. It's, um, you know, there's only one really bad spot on this tractor, and it's right there. That's a hole, and it's um, right there, too, and all under the seat. But, yeah. Otherwise, it's a really good tractor. These tractors are not common, especially the 1056 model. So, yeah, one of these years I am going to restore it. But, yeah, so it does occasionally, well, I shouldn't say occasionally, it always pops. Like, the engine is, like, when it's running, the engine is, like, popping. And so that this engine does need a valve job. And also it needs a muffler, but I got an NOS brand new um Kohler muff bleh, muffler with the tractor and um yeah and the way you read what tractor this is oh and also this sticker is not original what should be right here is what's like right there that sticker but anyways so how you read this is so this digit right here it's for 1966. Now, the 5 tells you it's going to be the next year. So, that would... You know, you'd think they'd make it 1966. But, no. When this, when these tractors were made in the 70s, um, it would say model 1066. For some year, it was always a year behind. And then, this stands for horsepower. So, this is a 10 horsepower and yeah so that's the year so five is 60 and then six is the so 66 and then 10 horsepower so that's that now i did change the rear wheels on it that from another tractor we had and yeah so that's that now i did buff this whole tractor and then it did leave some of the buffing compound in the rough spots, but I don't know if you guys can tell, but it is very shiny. So that's that. And yeah. Now, if I was doing this video when it, when it was bright daylight, sun outside, this whole tractor would be all gleaming. Like, yeah, you can kind of see the shininess. But anyways, yeah. So, um, yeah, cool. So, it's, um, now you simply just, so, to open the hood, this piece, come on camera, focus. This piece will be all the way back, and then you're just going to want to pull forward like this, and then grab the hood. Just like that, and then it goes down like this. So, yeah. Anyways, so right here, um, me and my dad took this off, and we repainted the whole gas tank, and we got another fuel cap for it because my dad lost it. And, yeah. So, that's that, and as you can see, it was bought at 10 Ke Tegner e Implement, in Willoughby, Ohio. 
that's where the tractor is bought and it's a factory wheel horse dealer because it's wheel horse sales and services so yeah and right now what I'm actually doing is shutting the fuel valve off and there we go okay so that's shut off you know me and my dad repainted this we also painted this put a new ignition coil in it got a Japanese carb because the other one was junk so we put an E3 spark plug in it and this thing fires like on the like you barely have to even hit the key and we also did put a new fuel pump on it so yeah and as you can see right here it is a Kohler 10 horse so yeah we also put um, a new voltage regulator on it and all that stuff so yeah it was pretty fun doing all the stuff that we did it was sitting in our garage for a long time just waiting for me and uh yeah so that's that um i guess i could start it up for you so let's go hit the key uh, All right, guys, um, so I had a little bit of technical difficulties right there, but anyways, let's hit the key. Okay, make sure it's not out of gear. And... All Um, that was my tractor uh, running and yeah so I uh, hope you guys enjoyed make sure to uh, like and subscribe feel free to leave a comment and yeah well see you guys later bye